Hi everybody, welcome back to the Home of Crybaby Performance, where today we are going to check the max lift on our 160 project. Okay, so you want to take the lash out of the rocker arm. We put a feeler gauge in between the rocker arm and the tip of the valve to take up the lash. You can also tighten those nuts um, to take up the valve lash as well. We have our tool here that's going to hold our gauge. Got to get it so that you can see it. Okay, you want to set that to zero. And then if we rotate the motor, okay, now the rocker arm just started moving. So that's 51, 52, 10, 20, 30, 40, about 41, 2, 3 and a half. The rule is 45, we're within the rule. Now, if you have to adjust a rocker arm to get more lift out of it, on this little ball right here, if you remove material off of that rocker arm, you will get more lift out of the rocker arm. That's how you can achieve that 245 number. The exhaust is 255, and it has the exhaust bump in there, so once the gauge goes to zero, it's going to swing back and then you have to re go to zero past the exhaust bump that's our quick and and easy max lift we also sell these tools it's a very easy check to check at the track we'll spin it around one more time so you can see it that's uh, one hundred thousandths two hundred ten twenty thirty 43. So well, within the rules and uh, good to go. Thanks for watching our video.